helicopter overhead. Okay, we're gonna plant a few more things in here. I think we have a few more honey kales, so we're gonna, we've got room to put them in here. the other one. Yeah, it has, has two. So let's see, let's put, we're going to put this one in here. There we go. Let's firm that down. And we'll put one more over here so soon well when I keep talking about this but at some point the turmeric will be moved from this space which will open up uh, this space or at least the space that the turmeric is now in will be opened up and we can put something in there um, probably I don't know it'll probably be more brassicas or something Wow, this time it's. Do we have a look? Here's the. This is the root. Look, there's these little. These plants must be coming up from little. Uh, well, from roots. From the rhizomes. They're shooting up into the ground. There's another one here. And there's one here, and there's a couple here. This is one plant, I think, but it's coming up, so. I'd love to dig it up right now, but uh, I'm going to wait until it all dies back because that's what I keep being told. Pity we never got a flower. I think it just wasn't warm enough. Well. The turmeric is still looking fantastic. Um, the leaves, the leaves are still, you know, remarkably uh, green. The they're holding their color really well, and the bottom leaves are starting to go a little bit yellow, a little bit browning. There is some; they are starting to curl here a bit. It's a it's a fantastic uh, sunny day today. It's really warm. It's uh, it's about 29 today, and it's October the 12th. So, but tomorrow, apparently, temperature is going to drop 12 degrees. Okay. So, I've got two more things which I bought this morning. Um, so these were advertised as black cabbage, but I don't think it is. I think this is curly. I think it's black kale. Let's dig a hole. This is all under net. Quite tricky. Okay. This is already quite tall. This black cabbage. Black. I think this is black kale, though. Tuscan kale, perhaps. But maybe that's not very f famous in Japan, so they just decided, let's call it black cabbage. People can understand that. Wow, it's quite a hefty plant. Look at the roots on there. Okay. In he goes. Is it he or she? There we go. That's that done. We'll put these uh, pins back on. Well, look at the kale. The kale is uh, is doing really well, and uh, it's really curly. And I can see I can see lots more um, little curly leaves coming up, ready to curl. It's the curly kale. The curly kale is looking great. I should eat it. It it looks good enough to eat, actually. 
everything is looking great. These brassicas, I feel, are like the brass section of this vegetable orchestra. My allotment orchestra, the brass of the brassicas, the solid, you know, no-nonsense vegetables that perform. They just perform, you know. There's no messing about. Cabbage white. Cabbage white, I guess, you know, there's enough here for everyone, as long as they don't, you know, eat all the good stuff. Wow, there's three, three cabbage whites here. Look at them. Can you see them? Whoa. It's a good day for them as well, of course, you know. It's sunny and uh, it's a good time to lay eggs. So if the caterpillars, you know, can come out. I guess there's a smell from the, from the cabbages. They just know. Anyway, I've got to do some work, if you'll excuse me. Um, but I think that's it. So I'm just going to leave the garden now to the mosquitoes and the cabbage whites. And they can have their way with it, because they've had their way with me. I'll see you next time. Until then, goodbye.